guys, how are you all? So I decided to do this a pretty quick video on how I lost my weight. Ever since I uh, posted my transformation picture on my Facebook account, many of my friends messaged me to reveal the secret of my weight loss. So here I am and I'm going to tell you everything, the background, how I uh, gain weight and, and what exactly I did to lose the weight. So let's get started. To begin with, uh, I... I started gaining weight in 2014. My mother was diagnosed with fourth uh, stage of cancer and I was pretty much devastated and I I was really broken and it just affected me on so many levels. I was so stressed and that it uh, it just created a hormonal imbalance in me and I was diagnosed with a slight PCOD. The doctor even said that this amount of PCOD doesn't really matter. Everybody has that. But I knew I have a hard life. <laughs> I've always been an unlucky child. So I knew it is going to come out somewhere. So uh, the PCOD and my overeating. Like I'm an emotional eater. I eat when I'm hungry, when I'm sad, when I'm angry, when I'm happy, when I'm frustrated. Basically, I eat for every emotion of mine. I overeat. And the third thing was pregnancy. Pregnancy was tough for my body. I had to undergo medical treatments because of that PCOD. So the hormonal injections, the medicines, a laparoscopic operation, everything resulted into a weight gain of around 20 kgs. So when I... Um, uh, when I was diagnosed with PCOE, I gained 2 kgs. I used to be at 64. I was on 66 now. When I got married, I felt a little settled and I started eating haphazardly, literally. And then I gained more 2 kgs, which I again ignored. I was on 68 now. After the laparoscopic operation for my pregnancy, I was on 72. And when I got pregnant, I started gaining weight, like oodles of weight, no looking back, and I reached up to 86 kgs. So I had a C-section, so I definitely could not get up and start working like that. So I had to take a rest of six um, months, complete bed rest. Then for three months, I made up my mind. I started thinking thinking how to lose weight. I googled um, about weight loss. I watched many YouTube videos and I formulated a plan for myself. The foundation of the plan was eating healthy and exercising. I realized that it does not really depend on what exercise you do unless you are very consistent with it. And I have really experienced this when I started gymming in two, uh, like in 2018, in October 2018, I start I joined my back again after maternity, and also I started gymming. I did this in the pretty much same month. So it was taking toll on my body since I had lost my flexibility, strength, and stamina. But I kept on motivating myself. I kept on. Um, telling myself that I cannot stop and this is very important you get your willpower and determination only when you have given a proper thought to it the time which I had utilized for thinking it just helped me to keep on with my crazy schedule my child my house my bank and my gymming everything was pretty much overwhelming for me but I kept on this schedule for six months and in my gym I used to um, basically focus on cardio because I still did not have strength for weight training. At the last month of my gym I had um, you know reached up to five kgs of weight training. I could not really sustain the weights and all. Weight training, in fact, is really good. If you can 
please go to the gym and weight train. It is going to give you instant results. But when I say instant results, as instantly I started losing weight, that instantly I started gaining weight after I left the gym. I was pretty much sure that I cannot keep on gymming for throughout my life. It wasn't really feasible for me. I could not spare time because being a mom, it already takes a lot of uh, your time towards to in, in your house. And uh, I couldn't really leave him again and go um, out for gymming because I have already been away from him uh, throughout the day almost uh, for my bank. So it wasn't feasible for me. So I started home workouts after that. I started walking, I started Surya Namaskars and they also uh, have similar kind of effect if you're consistent with it. Now presently I work out for 30 minutes. My workout consists of 12 Surya Namaskars, a little bit of flexing. If I have, if I'm, you know, if uh, I'm not late, I do some yoga and if if in case i cannot uh, find time in the morning i walk in the evening in my society so this is all about the exercises here i would like to again remind you if you can please go to the gym please do weight training it's going to give you instant result and if you can please be persistent with it don't leave it in the middle just in the way like i did because it's going to result in weight gain and this is about exercising then I come to the major point diet since I told you I had been overeating um, like I have I have always been an emotional eater so it had to be checked so uh, how I started keeping a track of what I'm eating well, I have an app healthy find me app i don't use it now but when i was uh, trying to lose weight i used to like use it every time i eat so i would know how much calories i have eaten i don't really recommend you to keep on counting the calories it has to be nutrition over calories always i had even gone to a dietitian but unfortunately given to my crazy schedule i could not keep up with diet I could not uh, spare time for frequent eatings so I decided to stick to my traditional diet only. Today my diet consists of vegetarian food, green veggies, fruits, roti, rice, everything. I did not give up on any of the food, uh, food stuff. Only bakery and junk food. I stay away from them. I do not uh, eat pani puri in every every day now. I that was that used to be my problem. I used to eat pani puri like literally every single day. So I have controlled my uh, cravings, and I keep a check on what I'm eating, and I eat everything in moderation. This is very important. Moderation means not less not more just right in the middle so this is very important you ca you should not starve yourself i had done that i tried dixit diet like eating in the morning and then eating right at uh, at the dinner time i starved the whole day i did this for two months but this resulted into hyper acidity and low blood pressure and also i was drained of energies even though I lost 2 kgs in 2 months, I gained back once I uh, went on my regular diet. So I decided to stick to my traditional food and I decided to eat 3 times a day. I take, I uh, have spare time for my breakfast, then lunch and then dinner. And in, middle, in, in between, whenever I feel like eating, I eat roasted chana, I eat biscuits, because see, the um, pe many companies claim um, of you know uh, fat free biscuits and um, you know digestive biscuits it's nothing like that of sorts everything has uh, if you compare they have both same kind of effect I do not starve my body whenever whatever is available healthy option I eat it then coming to 
the third most thing that is discipline taking enough sleep it's really important to sleep because it just keeps your body in like in check it it, it keeps your hormones in place it keeps you fresh it keeps you active and um, i recommend a book to you the book is by rutuja devikar wait a second this is the book is the only book i have for weight loss for dieting and rutuja devikar is a very good um, nutritionist she is a celebrity nutritionist and she um, whatever she says in this book is really helpful it's an eye opener guys if you have any problem with your dieting you must read this book i do not recommend anybody to go for any sorts of herbalite or uh, crazy dieting ideas like dikshit diet i don't recommend all these things because it's it's going to take toll on your body so my weight loss journey just consisted of three things eating healthy workout and a proper lifestyle i have been working on my lifestyle i have been controlling myself from uh, you know going drastic i'm just trying to be more productive each day more active i less uh, i spend less time on bed i don't uh, sleep a lot i don't sit a lot i keep on choosing healthy options like climbing stairs or uh, probably working or playing with my child i'm just trying to keep myself active i find uh, healthier options in my day to day life and this is the only way you can get uh, rid of your laziness all i recommend you guys is to make changes in your lifestyle don't uh, do anything drastic for your weight be consistent with your diet consistent with your workouts it is going to uh, give you result and those results are going to be permanent you won't be gaining back again unless and until you're sticking to them so this is all i hope it it was helpful for you if it was make sure you like my video and subscribe to my channel and bye take care